Hello and welcome to the Admiral Production Facility. My name is Joel and today I am here instead of in the studio because we are going to assemble an Admiral Snake for you. This Admiral Snake is three meters in length by six meters in height. And I'm gonna explain a little bit about the components in front of me now. We have an Admiral length gutter, which is the base of your snake. We have an Admiral length gutter with an attachment on the side. We got some brass bearings here, small and large. We got some washers, some pop nails. We have our hinges here. We have our catching arms over here, our connection points. And we have a extra package here that'll be used to connect your snake to a tube. But we'll talk about that later. Now, when assembling your Admiral Snake, make sure that you always begin with a length gutter that has a connection component on the side. To begin, first take your connection point here, slide it into your length gutter. Make sure that this part of the connection point is facing out. Take a small brass bearing, make sure it's the smaller variety of the two bearings that we provide. On the inside, washer on the outside, your pop nail then sits there. Everything is assembled together. And we're ready to go. Simply attach the other side and you've started with step one. Now that we've attached our connection point to our snake, it's time to add another length gutter. If we were building a two meter snake, we could attach a length gutter without an additional component here. But because we are building a three meter snake today, we must make sure that we attach another length gutter that has this connection component to it. Let's begin. Now that our two length gutters are lined up, we slide in and line up the connection points. Now make sure you always use a larger brass bearing between length gutters. This is the only time that the larger length gutters are required. Otherwise, every other part will fit the smaller variety. Slide in your pop nail, a little bit of Dutch for you, and Now that we've attached two of our length gutters together, we can add the third and final piece to complete the base. And because this is the last piece, we can add one without a connection component. But make sure that this edge is facing your connection point. When mounting your hinge piece over here, please be advised to make sure that this piece here with a single edge is where it's attached. There are multiple ways to attach this, but this is the only way to correctly attach it. Slide it in and make sure that we're using our smaller brass bearings as well. Now that we've finished assembling the first layer of the snake, it's time to assemble the second layer. Now, because we are assembling a three by six meter high snake, we're gonna begin with a length gutter that has a connection component here, and then finish off the second layer with a length gutter without a connection component. Now, make sure you have the proper brass bearings for each section. Remember, the small brass bearings may be at the end, and the larger brass bearings are in the middle. So let's begin by attaching this over here. Using the same process as before, we can assemble the second layer. Now when attaching these hinges, always make sure that you attach the piece with no edge next to your length gutter. And when attaching the last and final piece of our snake, make sure that this edge is attached to your hinge. As you can see here, we have fully assembled our snake. And what is important to note is that this connection point here is pointing away from your snake. 
That'll indicate that you've assembled it well and you've made no mistakes. Very important. Now also we provide you, when ordering the snake, with two catching arms and a mounting kit. Now I'm going to show you with a close-up how this mounting kit works. For your mounting or assembly kit, we have four horseshoe shaped profiles as well as self-locking nuts and bigger nuts that are used to attach your catching arms to your snake. Note that we have these plastic covers that will provide protection for your snake and these self-locking nuts attach the horseshoe shaped profiles to the connection points of your snake. As an option, should you want to attach your snake to a truss, we offer an extension set for a truss. Now these extension sets come for a 30 year truss and a 40 year truss. Here you can see the truss extension kit, which adds some parts, some extra self-locking nuts, some length profiles to your mounting kit already. And this allows you to attach your snake and catching arms to a truss. And so there you have it, a video demonstrating the fully assembled Admiral Snake. I hope this video will help you assemble your snake and you'll enjoy this product as much as we do. For everybody here at Admiral, I'm Joel. Thanks for watching.